Alan Carr, 46, described himself as an a-hole for his comments on the late Amy Winehouse, who died in 2011. The comedian is well known for his extroverted personality and is no stranger to sharing loud remarks. In a new interview with The Guardian, he went down memory lane, discussed his love life and spoke about his upcoming show. The chatty man remembered one particular skit which he now regrets given the circumstances. Alan shared how he feels like such an a-hole for impersonating the rehab singer in 2008 at the Amnesty Secret Policeman's Ball. The innocuous phone call that would crash Philip Schofield's career 12 years later he recalled doing an impression of her squawky North London accent as a joke, before realizing what she was going through. Amy died at the age of 27 and was revealed to be battling alcohol addiction. He shared that having lived with someone with addiction he had seen how out of control it is and the emotional turmoil. He added that he was completely naive when he did the joke in his 20s. However, he realized the consequence of his actions stating that at 40 he had no answers at all. You are just stumbling through life, messing up and apologizing. The former Happy Hour host also spoke about another departure in his life. Last year, the Dorset-born star split from his partner of 14 years, Paul Drayton. A close friend and singer Adele officiated the wedding in January 2018 in Los Angeles. Don't miss, Piers Morgan's one-word reaction to Philip Schofield affair after defending him, reaction, countdown star Rachel Riley says she and husband put a pin in romance, latest, strictly zany doubt and scene for first time since breast cancer news, updates, however, the two were revealed to have separated in January 2022 not long after Paul was convicted of drink driving. Paul previously revealed that he struggled with alcoholism, posting on Instagram that same month that he had checked into rehab. The Independent reported that a spokesperson shared that the two split jointly and amicably. When asked how he felt nowadays, the stand-up comedian told The Guardian that he had never been happier. He added that he was now taking a bit more control of his life. Alan is busy with his next project, a show that will see the star return to his Northampton roots. The six-part series shows Alan in the present day with his younger self played by actor Oliver Savale. Changing Ends is co-written by Alan and Scottish BAFTA winner Simon Carlyle, in addition to Baby Cow Productions who worked on shows like Gavin and Stacey. Changing Ends will be available to watch on ITVX from June 1st.